Where? Hi, Dan. All right. So this morning at seven o'clock in the morning, after not getting any sleep, I decided to cook two rabbits in a crock pot. William Shatner, right here. Just kidding. No. So it is done. I cooked it for six hours. I got it out about two o'clock. Something like that. I didn't get it out. I just unplugged the crock pot and let it keep being hot in there. Yeah. Let's not talk about that. Anyway. So we're going to try it. I think six hours is too long. To be honest, I feel like I cooked it a bit much. But we'll let you guys decide. Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, 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 it's falling off. Look, it fell off. All right, so the front leg fell off. That's hot. Don't ever stick your finger in hot liquid. That's the back leg of the other one. Look at that. It looks pretty good, actually. So I'm going to kind of carve it up nice. Try to. That's the back. That's the tail. A little waggy bag. So we're just going to... Oh, man. I don't even... Who needs a knife? Come on now. So we got that. And then... I don't know. We'll just kind of fillet it like a fish, I guess. I'm not a butcher. I don't know these things. Oh my goodness. That back strap looking beautiful. Man. Applebee's, you might have a run for your money because uh, it looks like we're eating good in the neighborhood today. Oh. That's the little front leg. I ain't got much there. Oh. Ooh, buddy. Look at that rib right there. Mm. Pretty. Mm. Reminds me of that dude on Waterworld. <laughs> Beeper. It's paper. But. So yeah. We're gonna flip it over. <laughs> flip it in reverse. Sorry, I don't know why I keep saying that. It's just something dumb I do. It's what I do, yo. Well, this knife ain't doing what I want it to do, so I'm just gonna go in with my hands. Like our ancestors. Oh my goodness, one. Woo! That is pretty fine. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Hello. Okay. I'm just, you know, I haven't cooked rabbit a whole lot, so I'm just kind of looking through, grabbing what meat I can, because I don't like wasting. A little bit of this. Oh, look at that. Oh my goodness. That's the neck. Right there. You got to get that neck meat, man. That neck meat. And maybe not that neck, because that's all blood. If you like blood sausage, you can try it, but... This ain't Bizarre Foods with Andrew Zimmern, okay? Even though he is one of my idols, one of my cooking idols, he's actually the reason why I love cooking so much. Because he is the first cooking show 
His, not he, his was the first cooking show I ever watched. Uh, and it just, all the food around the world. Why are we limited to domestic pigs, cows, chickens? You know, why not explore the culinary world? So yeah, all right, now, now we're gonna do the taste test. Peyton! Here you go, taste test, look at the camera, that way. Tis a rat out. It's good. It's good? Yeah. I guess I'm a meat eater now. Yeah, well, are you? Alright, you can go. You taste it. Baby! I'm gonna do a little bit of this dark meat here. I'm pretty good actually it uh not too much seasonings or anything I don't know what happened to my wife but I'm gonna make my friend who's holding the camera my brother from another mother and my hands are dirty kid he gonna eat behind the camera because I ain't touching my camera with this. It's really good. It's good. He says it's good. But Ooh. I mean, uh, not dry at all. No, actually, it's really. Uh, it's a uh, pretty, pretty good. It's nice and moist, ready to go. So I didn't cook it overcook it like I thought I would and then uh, here's the other rabbit with the juices and everything oh baby why don't you come try my rabbit Alright, time out.